Hi everyone, hope you're well. I think we're going to keep on playing Judas. So I did pretty well with him last week. Um, okay. It's got that extra damage straight away. It's really good, isn't it? So it's, it's full damage. And two everything else. Starting with. So, special room. Got tarot cards instead of our extra damage. So, Hermit takes us into the shop. Doesn't it? Um, I don't think we're going to keep the tarot cards. I think we'll want to keep our extra damage book. But we'll come back and get it in a while. To collect up some tarot cards first and we know that book's fully charged so I usually just use it on the boss anyway so we'll just get it before going through the boss okay not much going on here what's it ah uh, okay right try and get this guy this room's nearly all taken up with rocks, it seems. <laughs> okay, so we can't actually get to the bombs unless we have a bomb first. And that's a little the beggar. So, um, I don't think it's going to be anything worth buying in a room. Buying in the shop for three coins, so we might want to use... Oh, well, we could use the hermit to... Shall we use it to get into the shop to see? I really don't think there's going to be anything worthwhile, so I think we'll just take the damage back. And then... Quite often get something for three coins off the beggar, so... I think we should... Give the coins to him. There we go. And it's another heart container, so that's really good. It's the kind of thing we need. Oh, I should use the book, shouldn't I? I forgot. <laughs> I forgot to use it. I might make things a bit... Oh, I've been hit now. I was doing quite well not getting hit there. But I have been hit now, so we don't need to worry about that. Oh, I said we don't need to worry about that, and then I die. Let's try that again, shall we? Right, so. That's a warm-up session. Okay, so... Take out Gish. Okay, it's another key. Oh, we don't actually have any already. It was just that key there I was thinking of that we can't get to. Okay. Again, similar to the last map. Lots of bombs, but contained in this area. That we need a bomb to get to. Okay. Same again, we need a bomb. So, oh guys, this um, inner riot shoots out the back. Oh no, it's on the front, this one. Okay, that's quite cool. Especially with our extra, extra damage, that should be quite awesome so I guess we'll go straight to the boss then it doesn't look like there's anything else to do everything's behind rocks and the secret room finding the secret room we obviously need a bomb as well so I got monster again so let's get our revenge choose the book 
This should be quite ridiculous. The only thing is, the actual shots are slower, but you get... So I think, in a, in a way, the rate's the same, but it's just three shots at once, so you just want to get those hits in. To make it worthwhile. Not much range at the moment. So I've got to get in a bit closer. There we go. Right, so... <clears throat> As range up, so that's what I was just complaining about, so it's a bit better. I don't want to tempt fate, but we haven't taken damage yet. So I'll just have a sip of tea. And we'll move forward. Sneaky mates are sneaky. Oh good, that was good. I thought I was going to get hit there. So that was not a great situation to be in. But we seem to have gotten away with it. And we've got an extra coin. Okay. Okay, we need some bombs for that. Take the, these little dudes out. They never really do much, these ones. Okay, we could do the arena. Shall we do the arena? I want to see if I can complete without getting damaged. So seeing as we've actually found the boss straight away, I want to just go to go for it. Let's use the book. Okay, that's one down. Yes, okay, so that's the achievement I wanted. So that's for Basement Boy for not taking any damage. So we've got that one now, so next we'll, next we'll need the caves. <laughs> um, what does that contract do? Is it damage up? Because if it is, oh no, it's spectral. Oh, okay, right, I need to remember that. That's a Ouija board with spectral tears. So I'm pretty happy I've got that achievement now, so I might just do the arena and risk it. Because I wish I hadn't picked up Spectral Tears, now I remember what it is. Because um, I quite often find them a bit annoying. They're good for groups and stuff, but um, they s seem to do less damage somehow. Sometimes. Might just be my imagination, I don't know. Okay. Right, so we've got some keys on us, so we could see if we could blow up this rock and test for a secret room. Oh, that was stupid. It wasn't close enough to the rock. Now I definitely want to die <laughs> unless something good happens. Okay, let's see what's in here. Another bomb. Okay. And it's a bit like I can't be bothered to put out fires with spectral tears because it takes too long. Well, the main main reason I find them annoying, really, I think, because I like putting out all the fires. I'm a bit OCD like that. We'll see if there's any coins in them. Okay. There's a blue rock there. Okay, so we shoot these ones because... Oh, this takes ages for spectral. Right. So they're not right up in our face as soon as they run towards us. Okay. I guess having a triple shot helps out a little bit with... Clearing those things for spectral tears. Especially at point blank. Okay, there we go. A coin and let's see what special item we've got. We've got four. Right, so chocolate milk. Um I'm getting used to it. 
and we still got our triple shot. So if we charge up, does that mean? Oh, that'll be interesting. Okay. Okay, so this could be quite interesting after all. Um, I think this is likely the secret room here. And it is. We get those coins. Don't bother with the fires. So we've almost got 15 coins, which is a good number for the shop. So it looks like that's all the rooms explored, but we don't have any more coins. So we will go through all this poop. Maybe if I charge up the shots a bit. See, not even that helps. Okay, there's a heart. Let's do that same thing again so we can get two at once with the spectral tears. No luck. Don't have a bomb anymore to blow up that blue rock. Um, there's fires. Take out the fires, see if there's any coins. Because we just need one coin for 15. No. Nope. Down this way. Oh yes, lots of fires. So I wonder if there's anywhere we can get. Is that far enough to get to at once? Not really. Let's do them this way. Nope. Firefighting with Isaac. <laughs> there is a really cool old SNES game actually. Um, where you're just firefighters. So you don't fight monsters or anything. Although actually there is like malfunctioning robots in one bit. But the whole game was just fighting fires. But, like, there's lots of different types of flames that move around and stuff. I always thought it was a really cool concept. Um, it's quite different. Oh, I just need one more coin. Um, I think we should have a look anyway, just in case, yeah. And, of course, there's two fires in here. As you can see. Oh, I just need one coin and we can get an extra heart. Um, I guess it's not the most amazing item ever extra heart so maybe we can live without it well let's oh no we've done the boss already haven't we I can't see any other options so I think we have to move on into the caves so I wonder if we can get the caves finish the caves without taking damage oh we can shoot the we can shoot from here because we've got spectral tears and there's a bomb but we can't get to it Okay, these guys are a pain, so make sure we dodge them. There we go. What's in the box? A couple of coins, so yeah, as many coins as we need for the shop, so that's good. I think that's attack fly. It is, excellent. Attack fly is very helpful. Oh, we got hit. Oh, we died. Oh, so fast. Ah, oh, how long was that then? Still only 13 minutes. Okay. Okay, so let's play. Let's do another attempt. One more, I think. There's a special gish. So yeah, it seems like it's much easier to die with Judas because he's got less health. However, it's it also seems a lot quicker to get places because of the extra damage. Um, I got hit, damn it. Um, because of the extra 
sure. I'm not sure I'm going to get to that one. I want to get the fly before I have to take on... Yeah. Ugh. Try again. Um, as I was saying, like, getting through the game seems a little bit quicker, though. So it kind of balances out. Because even fights that are easy um, take a little bit longer without extra damage because you just have to hit the mobs that, that many more times. Uh, there we go. Right. Is someone saying that you can shoot diagonally when you run or something? And you can't shoot diagonally with the mouse, can you? I think it must have been a glitch they were talking about. Um, I think the secret room might be there, but we'll have to wait and see. Yeah, well, hmm, it would be right next to the boss room, but I guess it's po possible. Don't often get secret rooms next to the boss room in my experience, but maybe I'll look around a bit more before checking. Mind you, this extra bomb now. Damage up, excellent. So, oh, it doesn't show up on the graph, though. Oh. Uh, back. Doesn't show up on the graph. Um, we'll see. So, we can get these bombs. Um, wonder if we put one... Here. I don't think it'd be close enough to check for secret room though. Um, I think it is going to be here. Yeah. Thought so. <laughs> it's quite bizarre with the big head, doesn't he? With the big head and the small hat. It's the hat that makes it look weirder than usual. <laughs> Uh, I don't think I left any hearts anywhere, so we'll go onwards. Oh, should, maybe I should have done that blue rock. I should have done, really, shouldn't I? We'll be alright. Oh, ho, ho, famous last words. Well, I'm really not doing well today. At least I've unlocked that um, achievement, which I've always wanted. So, there's one thing counts towards 100%ing the game. Um, okay, and these ones go have flies in, I think. Yep. Get the red one. Okay, there we go. We've got a coin there. Just shooty ones. And get the shoot. There we go. Try and get the shooty ones. Oh, it's gonna kill us. Um. Oh, it's moved. There it goes. Um. Actually, has the same amount of life than us in comparison. It takes two hits for us to kill it, and it can kill us in two hits. Um, still don't have any bombs to check for the secret room. Another key. Right, so this is where the special item is. One more. Okay. Monstro's tooth. I think we'll keep our extra damage. Thank you. Let's use Monstro's tooth again just while we've got it here because 
and you only use it when there's something actually in the area. Won't actually activate in an empty room. Yeah, so when you use it, Monstro comes down. So I think he comes down and kind of hits anything that's around. So I tried it on a boss, and I think it did a little bit of damage, but not a lot. So if you try it on normal mobs, maybe it's very helpful. Let's use, um, use our book just to speed it up a bit. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. It's just not good today. Shall we do one more? Let's do one more. <laughs> maybe I should switch to Isaac. Maybe I'm just... It's the, um... Having had a break over the weekend, I'm just not good enough. I haven't warmed up again. And now I'm just tilting. Right, let's get that shooting flying. Okay. Bombs. Excellent. Troll bomb. Not so good. Okay. Oh, interesting. Is that a... Oh, that's the um, Yum Heart item which heals you up. Actually, not so useful when we have use it just for a laugh it does actually let us as well even when we don't need it um not actually so useful when you've only got one heart so i'll leave that there a few loads of you guys say using that item was a waste now aren't you because it was because i could have actually used it but i was thinking i wouldn't need it but i guess with half a heart it could heal half a heart but meh I don't really care. Like I said, I'm on tilt at the moment. It's hopefully some of you know what that means. Basically, just means I'm uh, I'm being reckless and careless. And the more I lose, the worse it gets. Take out these fires. See if there's anything in them. Nope. Let's see what's in the chest. More bombs! Cool. So we found the secret room. Um, so we could go do that. Chest and key. And we don't have any keys already, so we did need to do that. Almost thought maybe that was a mistake for a second. Oh, and now we've got 15 coins, but we can't get into the... Oh, shop. Okay, well, it's only level 1, so I think what's in the shop usually is determined by what level you're on as well. So, level 1 shop isn't necessarily as good. In my experience, anyway, it might be completely wrong. But that's the impression I get. Now, I can't get hit again. This boss is usually really boring, but when you know you can't, you mustn't get hit even once, it suddenly becomes a lot more tense. Um, okay. Killed that one. Let's just try and leave the poop as much as possible so that it blocks them off a bit. Die, damn it. Yes. Right. Is this damage up? Tears up. Cool. More coins. No more keys, however. I don't think there was any blue rocks around, so we'll move on to the next one. Ah, oh, this is hectic. Somehow I've avoided getting hit. Wow, there's loads of them. This tears up is pretty cool. 
guess maybe the tears up. Maybe I was shooting the shots out the air, was I? Because I've got quite a lot of tears flying out. So that's cool. Um, Hierophant is hearts, isn't it? Yes. Very good. Could use a bomb here, as we're going to need to use one anyway. Took out one of them at least. I should say we're going to need to use one. I don't actually have a key to open that, so... Oh well, we've still got one more key to get the secret room. Hopefully it'll be in an obvious place and there won't be too many options. Now, these don't ever seem to actually get damaged by the fire when they're on fire. So we still have to get them. They just damage us more, I think. So, what's this? Health up. Cool. Let's see if there's anything in the fires. We don't need to worry about opening that chest by mistake when we don't have a key yet. Because we'll want to save the key for the shop. Oh, and the special item. Special item room's locked. Um, see if we can get one in the arcade. Full health. Cool. So, um, spend a couple of coins in here. See if we can get a key. Got a bomb. Those of you are really freaking out every time I don't use the, um, oh, whoops, I spent too many coins. Damn. get some from this. Those are people really freaking out when I don't use that machine. Um, but anyway. And there is a heart in here. Oh, okay. Um, let's save it for a fight though. Let's fight all the monsters we can first and then um, Okay. That was not a good place to be in. Not a fan of these jumpy things. I think when the expansion eventually comes out, saying there's going to be lots of spiders, and I think the spiders are going to jump around like those things, which is going to make it really tough. Um. So here's a bomb we can use. Not a bomb, a key. So we don't want to use it on the chest, we want to use it on the item room first. What we got speed and range, cool. Looks good. Sneaky meats. Meats of the sneaky variety. Okay. Oh. There we go. Another key. Um, we want to use it on the shop because we've got 16 coins. So we've got another power up there that looks like the option we want. Speed and damage. So how are we doing? Wow, look at this. Full damage. Oh, if we got full damage. I really want to know if the book, if we got full damage, if the book does even more damage or if it's not worth using because we're already maxed out. But yeah, this looks good. This looks very good. So we could do with some more heart containers, maybe. Um, but beyond that, we're pretty set. Once we kill everything before it kills us. Bam! In the face. Right. Um, we can get a bomb back. Because there's one in there, so we can open this. And there's another bomb in the chest, which is very good. And there's a heart. 
also good. Well, it's so is is that thing again when when it's full speed, I'm not used to it. It's like it's too fast. So at least I know it, it won't get any faster than this. If I can get a bit used to this speed, then I'll be all right. Um, right. So I reckon one of these is the secret room. So we'll try up first because that's where we are, and we'll try this one. Oh, neither of them. Ah, okay. Oh, I bet it's that one over under the chest, isn't it? And we've used up our bombs now, so we can't... Oh, no, we just need a key. Oh, and it's giving us another bomb. Excellent. So let's blow up. Oh, no, it looks like I've tried it already. Shall I try it again? I'm just going to try it again. And that's really stupid. Yeah, see, it is there. So you do have to be kind of just on the mark to actually get it. So I'm running so fast I might almost run into fires if I'm not careful. So we could get some more stuff from the shop or... Or we could get some stuff from the arcade. Um, or we could save it for a good 15 coin item on the next floor which I think might be the best option. Because this is all items we don't really need. The blue heart might be worth it. Um, there's a heart there. So if we spend a heart on the donation machine. Got some more coins. Spend four coins on the slot machine. Two, three, four. No luck. No bombs to get our revenge. And then we'll grab that heart on the way back. So we've got full health again. Um, maybe I should take. Mm, I'll still have ten coins saved up if I take that spirit heart or whatever it's called now so I think I should so I'll kick myself if I don't and then I need it okay so Duke of Flies let's kind of try this out so that's how much damage one two three shots does without the item and then if we use the item two three or so um, so yeah, I don't think there's any difference. I mean, I, it's, I don't think there's any difference there. I mean, I can double check on the edit and obviously you guys can check. Now, this will be a video. You guys can re re rewind and check and stuff. But I think basically I've got maximum damage. So it's the item doesn't make any difference because I'm like capped kind of thing. Now we've got three hearts, so this is looking very good indeed. So into the caves. It's just so fast. I'm not used to it. It's almost harder. <laughs> um, well, actually, in, a, in some ways it is harder. So I feel like I'm not in control of myself. But at least I can get away quickly. Okay. Um, don't have any bombs. That would be a great bomb there. Because you get the blue rock as well as the items in the middle. So it looks like it's definitely worth it. Let's try and take out the small ones. Okay, we'll ignore that one. That last small one we can won't cause us too much trouble. We'll get it in the in passing. Oh, can we can hit. Doesn't look like we'll be getting caves no damage this this time round then. Um See what's 
what's up here? In some way, caves no damage might almost be easier when I when I make more effort to get it because if you have a good if you have a good first two levels in the in the basement and you get some really good items then even though the mobs are a little bit harder they're not so hard just yet um, you might have like good items to take them out like we have right now with our full damage and stuff which is crazy I just keep on wanting to look at the stats because full speed and full damage it's just so OP so So if I was actually trying, I might have been able to get no damage um, on this level, but I forgot. And I was being slack, so that's where the boss is. See if we can get two more coins. Maybe some bombs would be good. Okay. Looks like that might be where the secret room is, above this room. Oh. It's not good form at all, I'm running into them. Should be able to take them out really fast with full damage, but there you go. Um. Oh, this isn't good, is it? Right. Just pretend we're at the start of the game again with only one heart. Until we find some hearts. Right, this is where the shop is. We've got six keys. So I think it's worth having a look. Right, so the only 15 coin item is a teleporter, which I don't really care about. So I don't mind spending two on a heart because that's cheap. And we'll get another heart as well. So if we go out and then we die, that would just be stupid. Um, I think we should get the bomb as well. So teleporter is the only item. And then the next, next time we get it, um, next time we get the shop, knowing our luck, it will probably be the greed mini boss. So, right, so we've got some more coins. Maybe we should have just mm, kept the bomb. I bet there was a bomb behind one of those rocks. Oh, actually, maybe not. But there might have been in one of the chests behind the rocks. Uh, Mum's bra item. Shall we take this then? I'm pretty sure. I might kick myself if I check my video. But when I was watching the health bar on Duke of Flies, I'm pretty sure that our damage is like capped. So the book is it's pointless using the book. It just continues to do the same damage. So if we use the bra, then at least we know that it does something. So it's Chubb. So let's move out the way of... Let's get a little dude. Let's move out the way of that attack. Oh, he has paused. Get these guys. Oh, he will spawn more of those guys, so... so. It's almost better just to ignore them as much as possible and just take out the main boss. Oh, ah, shoot. Okay, done. So we can heal up and we've got another heart container. So I think we're done for this floor. Oh, I thought, I was just about to say, these guys are easy now I've got max damage, but it still managed to get all the way up to me. So being a bit complacent there. Right, so we've got poisonous Larry. It's not happy as Larry, he is poisonous as Larry. <laughs> um. Oh, what's going on there? That's weird. Okay, now we've got him. Right, so there's a bomb in that little bit there. So if we do get a bomb, we know we can use it on this one first and we'll get one back. 
Hmm. Okay, the full speed was pretty helpful there. Bad trip, damn. Apparently you can't be killed by bad trip. Apparently if you get bad trip with only one heart, it actually heals you all the way up. So um, that's worth remembering. Unless someone was just trolling me, but it sounds like it might be true. So it'd be, that would be super harsh. I mean, it's a pretty harsh game anyway, but that would be really harsh if you just try a pill and then you die. Um, that would be a bit too much like real life. You probably shouldn't try pills that you don't know what they are in real life. Um, do we want to do this? Not really. Um... Okay, I'm going to blow it up. I don't care what anyone says. Somebody has some tactic I haven't thought of in keeping it there, but... Um, right now, I've only got one heart, so... Okay, I don't think the secret room is there, then. Unless that bomb wasn't in the right spot. Um, oh, that's all the bombs we have for the moment. Sneaky meat. Okay. Almost done. Okay, got it. And... Take these guys out. Excellent. Ah, it's coin in the middle of that. Excellent. Um, see what's in the secret room. Oh, special room. Anarchist cookbook. That's an interesting one. Because we can take it just to blow up some rocks. So, it's like there's your chest back up here, which I presume is behind some rocks. Yep. So, let's use it here. Let it go land. That's good to me. Right. And uh, set the heart, see what this does. Telepills, okay. So it didn't take us anywhere interesting, but we know which one it is now. So let's go back down here and finish exploring. Oh, actually, let's get our item back as well. Get that back. So I think we want to keep that. I don't know, I think I want to keep it anyway. It's useful for bosses and stuff. I mean, having... Having Anarchist Cookbook might be useful if we don't find any bombs, but... I mean, we should be able to find bombs, really. Oh, let's run over this way. There we go. Right. Ooh, a chest. Cool. Very nice. Right. So we could get stuff in the arcade as well. Let's get half a heart to that. Take that heart. Get a coin. Um, have we been in the shop? We haven't been in the shop on this level. Um, let's check this room over here before we play any of the arcade. Maybe we should look in the shop just in case something's half price and then go in the arcade and we'll know if we want money or not depending what's in the shop presuming it's not greed there's a good chance it might be at this point okay got key
Yeah, but it's greed. Thought it might be. This should give us lots of coins for the arcade then, actually. Ow. Do you mind? <laughs> Who do you think you are? Right. Ah, oh, so we've got a half price sale if we do get another shop, so we won't need as many coins anyway. Um, I think we can probably not worry about that too much at the moment and just see what items we can get from the arcade, see if we can get some bombs and stuff, see if we can heal up. So... Let's play this until it breaks. Or we run out of money, whichever one comes first. So that's another bomb. We haven't found the secret room still. And I think we found out it wasn't wasn't the one top right. I don't know if it's if we checked the one two spaces above us here. I'll use the mouse. I don't know if we checked that one there, I can't remember. And then also down here might be one. It's another bomb, so we can check both if we don't see any scorch marks on the ground. More coins. Heart, thank you very much, that's good. Maybe we should do the um, arena as well before the boss then. See if we get anything good. Right, so there's no scorch mark in this room, or this room, so it looks like we haven't checked it, as far as I can see. Oh, might have checked over to the left, but no, we clearly didn't, because it is this room. Shall we go back to the arcade again, see if we can get any more stuff? I think we should. Get a pill or a tarot card or something. Okay, um, so we use two more coins on this guy. Just to guess the middle because I'm lazy. Okay, and I'm going to uh, I think I'm going to blow this up. Then I'm going to blow that up because sometimes you get that blood bag thing. Okay. Um, oh, it's one more coin. Uh, sorry for anyone getting bored. We are almost done now, so we'll just use that one more time. We've got a bomb, which we can blow him up with if we win it. He blew himself up with a troll bomb. That wasn't, that wasn't too bright of him. That's health down. We definitely don't want to use that, do we? So we'll just ignore that until some till we find something that swaps itself out with it. More bombs, cool. Cut the maggots. Oh, whoops. Okay, Q Q, Q Q Q. Can't hide behind anything in here, can you? You annoying things. These guys always hide. Wait. QQ! And so. Oh. Come on. Right. And this guy doesn't. This guy you can hit all the time. So that's that done. Half the health we went in with. <laughs> that wasn't so great. Um, I don't think we have any more options now. So let's we'll see who we've got. Gertie, let's try and find our spot then, shall we? Let's try and pause everything, take these ones out. I see that one can probably stay, but we've got enough. Um, so I think it's about here, isn't it? Usually works. And, um... Oh, this isn't. Unless we kill it super quick, if we get hit, we're screwed. Come on. <laughs> 
Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, 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 yes. Grab that heart. Um, just in case the fly hits us. Okay, excellent. Is this another damage up? I don't think we really need it, do we? I think we've already maxed out damage. Um, so I can't, com can't really complain, but it would have been nice to have got something else. So, into the depths. For one of these machines. Don't really want to give away our hearts, so we're going to blow it up. Lots of coins. Pick these out. It's a weeding, right. It's a gardening there. Um, okay, machine. We'll ignore that for the moment. Maybe get, into, get up to it and play it in a bit. Okay, finally swapped out that pill we don't want. And it's speed up, so that's good. Okay, this guy's trying to hide again. Also not a good room for them really though, this one. Because they'll... Nowhere to run, really. Bad gas, okay. Oh, lots of shots flying around. Take out these. Okay, cool, cool. So that's the boss there. Um, don't want to pick that up again, because it's just a distraction. Half a heart, nice. Yeah, you know you're in dire straits when you're happy to see half a heart. Um, oh, come on. There we go. Right, we're full, fully healed at the moment. Okay, we'll leave that bomb. I know it's like one bomb to get a bomb, but if we get something where we can float o over, I've started thinking that actually it's better to wait because it makes no difference and if you get something where you can get it for free then it does make a difference so got a heart out of that possibly a secret room here as well shall we have a look and it is okay cool so that's that sorted we've almost got 15 coins and we've killed greed so we know it's not going to be him again so, and actually, um, we should use the bomb to get five coins. So we could also use it on the arcade machine, like the, um, the fruit machine, but no guarantee we'd get five coins out of that, so I think that's a pretty good deal. And we've got the Bible, or oh, it's Book of Revelations, is it the same thing? Does it, um, no, I think it's just, you just get the horseman with Book of Revelations, don't you? But you also get cool items, like, or do you always get an extra blue heart? I think you always get an extra blue heart, don't you? So let's take the bomb, because they're always useful, and we've got lots of coins left. And shall we use this machine? I think we should. Right. Let's see what we got. More health. Nothing. More health. <laughs> ah. Yes, so I've got the dollar, which gives you 99 cents. And if you get 50 cents or more in one playthrough, you get cane. I don't know if that's like total throughout the playthrough or if you have to have 50 cents all at the same time. But either way, I've now unlocked Kane, so that's cool. And I somehow got hurt, but not hurt there. Did I have... Oh, did I lose my blue heart? Is that what it was? So cool, so we've unlocked Kane as well today. Oh, and the lucky foot. So I think that's Kane's item. Um, and we just needed to enter a new room for the game to acknowledge it. So we've got keys behind rocks there. We've only got one bomb, so... The machine blew itself up, so... It's 
is expecting to blow. I don't like these guys. Let's just let's just use the bomb to get out of here. <laughs> I can't be bothered with all of that. Let's just go and take on the boss. I think. Um. I th I think that's a wise option anyway, because I'm not. I'm going to get hurt in that room. I'm going to get hurt really badly. So. So it's war. What is it good for? Apparently, absolutely nothing. <laughs> um, apart from getting cubes of meat. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, that's not a lot of fun. Okay, we've got full damage and we're speedy. So you can run after us all we like all he likes, but we've got our Usain Bolt on. So we've got our full speed still. I think these two haven't gone up at all, have they? Since we got full speed. I'm just gonna have a sip of tea. So we've got one cube of meat. Whether we're gonna get another now, I'm not so sure. So we've got the Book of Revelations a bit late on. Okay, look out for those turrets. Try and get this brain sorted. Haven't got any bombs at the moment. A shop would be good though, with our dollar. Or 99 cents. We somehow lose the cent when we pick up the dollar. But that's just obviously the maximum coins we can carry in the game. Bad gas, let's save it for a fight, we might as well. Use it here in fact, poison that one down there. Yeah, and that poison worked, it killed it as well. Didn't just damage it, so that was worthwhile. Uh, can we even pick it up? We can actually, but I don't think we need to worry about coins at all now. Oh, this is a pain. I think these are ones that explode into shots, though, aren't they? Yeah, so at least they're not, ex at least they're not explosive ones, because that could get messy. Okay, and... Two more. Okay, sorted. It's down this... Oh, screaming babies again. Oh, crap, down to one heart. It's not good. Not good at all. And they teleport out of the way. Oh, man. Right. One more. Where's it gone? Over there. Yes. Okay. Oh, and we've got a blue heart and our items charged so we can get another blue heart. This looks like it might be a secret room. And it is. And it's coins, just what we don't need. <laughs> oh well. Half hoping it might be a one up there, but it's not. Let's see what's over in this corner then. Bunch of these guys just run away. And... Once we take their, separate their heads from the body, they're not too bad. Okay, we should be all right now. Okay. Sorted. Oh, I like these things. Oh, awkward. Okay, there we go. Um. I'm trying to find the right. That that's the spot I wanted, but it's dead now anyway. So, okay, let's um, get along the top. That should be enough. Yep. And oh, let's get here. Take that one out. Good stuff. Okay, that's where the boss is then. So we've cleared the way to the boss. Which will it be, Mum? Just yet? 
I think the depth's number two. I think it will be right up. I'm not sure if we'll be in a position to get her today unless we get our health back up. Um, we could find a shop. Might be able to get tons of stuff. What's this one? They speed up even more. Again, I think it's the same thing. I think our speed is capped. So any kind of speed up isn't going to make us any faster. Same as um, same as damage up. Right, so still a chest point of rock. Bunch of these guys. We'll kill them quite fast though, thankfully. Okay, so chest point of key. Key's okay, but lots of keys. Get a key in return. Oh, and we used it. Oh well, we got one out of the chest, so that's not so bad. Um, okay, exploding flies took out themselves for me. Got another blue heart from the item. Looking good. Oh, and these guys. I don't have a bomb to be lazy and escape this time, so I'll have to sort them out. Oh, ah! ah, ah! Not fair. God damn it. <laughs> what am I meant to do? <laughs> um, okay, get them in the back. Oh, at least I can kind of one hit them then. Kind of. One or two hit them with this damage. Okay. Whew. They're such a nuisance, those ones. Especially in a small space like that. It's, oh. They're not my favourite, put it that way. Mind you, there's always one mob that isn't my favourite. It used to be the poppy up ones, and it used to be the jumpy ones. But then I slowly get used to them, so hopefully I'll slowly get used to all of them over time. Okay, that's cool. Let's see what item we've got. It's a power, some kind of fire rate. That's cool, that's one that we could do with. Not speed or damage. So how's our fire rate? Fire rate's maximum as well. Wow. What's this one? That must be range, I guess. Um, but I mean, our range seems okay. I mean, if we stand here... Oh, it's about half the screen, so I guess full range would be all the way across sideways. I presume. I'm so speedy. This is mental. If I did get maximum stats, like if I got maximum range as well, that'd be insane. I would make for a very straightforward video title as well. So, um, there's another. Oh, yeah, we can have an arcade. I want to see. Um, let's get a heart, shall we? I will go and find a shop as well, though. Get as many items as possible. You can almost leave the coins on the floor and then... I just want a heart and then we'll move. Half a oh, I'll leave that half a heart. Okay, we'll come back there in a minute once we've explored everywhere. We do have a bomb. So we've got a whole dollar to spend in the arcade. It might almost be the first video I have to actually cut. Um Oh, so those are both items. I kind of want to keep the... Oh, here's a bomb. Um, here's a pill. It's a speed up pill. Um, have a... I guess we could like pick them up and then drop them again, couldn't we? Pick them up. So we've just got so many coins. Pick them up. Get the card. Hanged man. That lets us float over stuff. It's only where that might be useful. I can't remember. Um, okay, and then the other one's force field, which 
Mm, maybe we should pick up for the boss. Um, so let's buy it so it's ready to pick up and we don't forget. But we could um, we could use that on Mum. What's this? Chariot. Oh yeah, that's um, that's what you call it. Um, unicorn attack thing. Excellent. Okay, I hope then this machine might blow up. So I don't have to play it forever, because it's going to take ages otherwise, on the vid video-wise. So what else are we looking at? There's... Oh, it's blowing itself up. Okay. So we can get a coin... Shame we didn't get a few more um, bombs out of that. Maybe we can get a bomb from this guy. I don't think there's any way of knowing which one it's under. We've got lots of bombs there, just what we wanted. Does this guy eventually just leave if he doesn't blow himself up? So that's another heart we can use. Put those there. If we run out of coins, we can use the... Um, I think there is some kind of unlock if you use the heart donation a lot. He's blowing himself up. Not really much you can do about that. I guess maybe I could try shooting the troll bomb out of the way before he dies. Before it goes off and save him. Be a bit advanced though. Two coins. Um Okay, just double check the shop again. I think we basically had everything, didn't we? Yeah. Um, so we've got lots of bombs now. So go see that chest again. I think it was presumed it was behind some box. Yeah, I think it's down in the corner. Yeah, it is. Okay, it is the one I remember. Speed up again. I don't think it does anything. At least we check what was in it. It might be more bombs. Um, as it is, we have less bombs now. But oh well. If only there's one more room, we could get an, yet another blue heart. But okay, so we'll go and do mum. So I think we'll have to drop the book of revelations because I think it is a bible that insta kills her. Um, oh, careful now. Um, what's that, hanged man? So we'll take the force field, and I think what we'll do is we'll shall we use the chariot early on? I don't think we should use the chariot early on, even. We should use both items when the heart is actually down. You know, about halfway through, or one is either way, it's down to halfway or down to a third. It like stays down so, and starts shooting at you and stuff. So I think I should use the force field and the chariot then. And I can use the chariot to just run into her. So, right, let's see how we do. Du -du. Dramatic music. Right. Oh no, what am I, I'm thinking of, we've still got the womb to go, haven't we? I'm getting confused. I'm sure lots of you are shouting at the screen just now. Um, right, so we have to... What's up? Oh, there it is. Okay. Deep in concentration. <laughs> okay. No. Oh, crap. 
Almost done. Almost done. There we go. Right, so speed up. So we didn't actually have to use either of the items. So, right, we'll try and get through the room as quickly as possible. So there's not a whole load you can get in the room. There isn't any shops and stuff. Um, should we do the arena? I don't really want to do the arena. I just feel it's a bit risky. I'm sure there's some really good reward if you do do it. But, um... I mean, when I did it before, you, you get actual bosses and stuff. So, um... Um, oh, I don't know. Shall we do it? We've got full health at the moment. Well, you we have to have full health to go in there, but I feel like we should just go straight for the boss. Oh. Zutalur! They're so fast. Okay. It's a heart back there. So we'll grab. Um, let's check over this way. Okay, got a chest, more coins. Um, I don't even know where to stand in here. I guess maybe in the middle. <laughs> They're all shooting sideways from the corners. Um, okay, got that one. Whew. Okay, that was a little bit hectic. Right. Um, secret room here, maybe. More coins. Um. Do with some item rooms. Hopefully it'll be nice and have some. Oh, I should have used. Yes, I know everyone. I should have used both items. I wasn't expecting to die just there. So I think that's probably enough for today. That's like one hour and a quarter. Of footage more or less so I will see you later oh and we unlocked lots of stuff didn't we like we've unlocked Kane so we can give him a shot next time and we also got the achievement for no damage in the basement so I'll try and get the one for the caves next so I will see you later